Def- so what you basically what you want to look today is how can you be able to offset something like this? How can you be able to offset say a wall, a column, a beam, not a beam, say wall and roof and any other thing that you will want to offset later on. For me, like uh, something like this one, I used the offset option too when I was doing the interior of this one and the ceiling. This was the option, the offset option. I d- was able to draw, uh, this one was a circle. Then after I've drawn this circle in line, the line, using the line option, the 2D line option. Once I've drawn this circle, then I offset it to the outer one. And then I come and draw the slab for the, this side and then the slab for this lower side. Same with the table. I've, like this one, I was I did draw the first circle, first circle, then offsetting to here, and then offsetting again. Yeah. So multiple offset. So offset will it will help you a lot, especially when you are designing something to do with the interior and also the exterior and any other thing that you want to do later on. So that's what you want to look at today. And remember to subscribe to this channel so that you can help us to grow. So what you need to do is you go to the window option. I'm not sure about the other Akikad version, but I'm sure they're the same. So you go to the window option and then you go to this one. Uh, Palettes. And then I'm going to the control box. You will go down to the control box. This one, the control box, and I click it. So once I have the control box here with me, this I will ask if you are able to offset things. So like now, I just want to offset this one. This is a line. So all I have to do is to click the line option. I make sure that you make sure that you have clicked the line option, and then I come here. This one is when you need the offset option. So you have a you have a lot of things with, but I'm not going to talk about them. You have this one, you have this one, you have this one, you have this one, you have all of these, which you will try to find out what you can do with them at your own time. But for now, I want to go with this one, which is the offset option. And then uh, this one is called magic one. So you can have it by pressing, long pressing. Uh, if you long press, the space bar you'll be able to get it but now you have it here it is closer so i click on it this is the magic wand option then you can see once i come to the line it is a line it is able to be highlighted and then i can offset to anything i want if i want to offset it again i can do something like this so say i was drawing a slab and i just wanted to draw my slab in this section only it will of course become easier because then I'll just go to this option and uh, so to have uh, if I want to draw my slab like to that section of course in most cases you, you will have to close this one so we, you will have to close it here then maybe if you want you can close it here as well and then uh, if I go to the slab option I can draw my slab uh, like that one and then maybe I can combine it by one so yeah so it this one this tool will help you to do a lot of things a lot of things a lot of stuff and of course say say you had a wall somewhere that you wanted to offset I have a wall like let me draw like uh, this one just a simple wall. Say I wanted to offset this kind of wall. All I have to, all I do is you click on the wall. You you click on this one. I mean, you make sure you have clicked the offset one. Then this one you'll be able to offset a copy if you click. If you go this way, I'll be able to offset a copy. So you can see I can do something like this again. I can repeat, and then I'm going to offset multiple 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 walls so where i am where i am uh, we have the reflective glasses on the window and the birds keep on keep on 
yeah the birds keep on making the noise that you, you can hear as if someone is knocking so this is what we have like this tool basically this is an offset tool it will help you to do more things you can offset a lot of things if you want to offset something all you have to do is to make sure you have selected that something like uh, if it is the slab i have to make sure i have selected or anything of that kind this one is always the best option say i wanted to draw something circular and i don't want it to be in i just want a circular slab on the outer ring i would use the this option it all for me i always use this option say i wanted this to be let me say 750 yeah then i can come and draw so like it is wise to close it but it depends with your out with your archicad i mean but mine let me close it and then i'm going to the slab option and i can do this and this and then yeah whatever something like this see i wanted to draw another one on top of this so then maybe i could do like this and click on this one on this one the one that i've just drawn let me delete this line so can click on this and maybe change this to 50 then you see we have something like this here so basically this is a very help helpful tool and i hope it will help you to do a lot of things thank you for watching